Hey everyone, I'm back. Yes, please. So let's get to the next cinematic. It is ironic, but... The people who have been attempting me pray for their own happiness by looking at a stained glass which shows the legend of the black monster and the moon child. Man, that really hurts my throat to do that. Him? The black monster. He appears in various legends. Various legends. As a demon. A demon. He against and devours the gods. He's a rebel. An evil plague that rejects peace in the world. Oh. God, that is the moon that never sets. Uh huh. That thing's ugly. It's an ugly nose. One hundred and eight. That number is keeps recurring, doesn't it? Harold. The Harold is known to us as the Moon Child. And the Moon Child. The legend says the, the Moon Child revives the gods on Earth uh -huh. and purifies the world. Purifies the, the world. black monster. Abhors, hates, and despises it. Why you gotta hate? Kills the Moon Child. Why you gotta hate? This sad karma is endless. Endless. This god stays forever in the sky. And the world is a never-ending chaos. Can I go now? I wanna fight things. I guy's getting munched. Alright. Come on, say something else. When you're making me talk over your, like, dead space here, where you're showing, like, stones and rocks and whatever that is. I, I don't know what I'm looking at here. I don't have, I, I, I don't have any kind of art education. I don't know what I'm looking at. It looks like some things on the right are, like, dancing or flying, and there's some other thing on the left about to do a Hadoken. Meanwhile, in neat. Now I can turn up the volume again, since it's not in the cinematic sequence. Nothing has changed. Am I hesitating? It's silly. Mother, I am back. Mother, it's been a while. Since the tragic day I lost my sight. I am able to see today, thanks to the love of many people like Satite here. May the divine tree bless all the victims of the tragedy. Who is it? I didn't mean to surprise you. You are? Just a traveler. Please don't be alarmed. Whew. Diffuse that situation pretty well. All right. What are we doing? There are people of meat and my mother sleeping here. Are you here to visit the grave too? I guess so. Or Setier, okay. Then you know about meat? Well, here goes another sequence. But it's not the, like, fancy kind, it's the other kind. Neat, 18 years ago. I gotta adjust the volume for this. Fire. Fire! Okay, there's a black monster. Where is Princess Luvia? I'll never tell you. Urgh. Ugh, that didn't look fun. I can't see! Mom, I'm scared! You can't see because she had her arm over your face. Uh-oh. Don't come! Where is Princess Lovia? Where did you hide the moon child? We don't know. What kind of spitefulness do you have toward our village? You want to die with your daughter? Mom, I'm scared! Princess Lovia left for the sea. This must be enough to satisfy you. Now leave this village! 
The chance to eliminate the moon child comes only once every 108 years. It's the time of birth when the moon glows a blood color. The newly born moon child has a new ma has a magic power. That magic power changes everyone and everyone around into an evangelist for the god, a servant to help prepare for the descendant uh, for the descending of the god. Ah! My objectives will not be satisfied until I kill every single person who is present as the moon child passed through. Mom, answer me. It's hot. It's burning. Mom. Mom. Oh man. Well, that's what happened to you. It was a miracle that I survived. I see. Then you were blinded back then? Yes. However, the god imparted me with something else. Sister Luana can see people's souls, but she can feel their pain too. Because of this, Sister Luana has suffered. Now I can appreciate this power that I have because it allows me to heal the pain in people's hearts. If you need to heal the pain in your heart, please tell me. I can help you. That's not necessary. By the way, are you done? Yes. I will go back to Din uh, Dinengrad soon. May I join you? Even if you are with knights, the forest is filled with dangerous monsters. I can protect you from them. I see. Then I'll ask you to come with us. Okay. Okay. So now we see where they go for their errands. Where is she? It's been a long time. I wonder if everybody's doing all right. I wonder if they feel lonely without me. Wow. Hey, watch out. Who is this coming through the boundary? Who are you not knowing me? Meru? Is that you, Meru? Guadalajara? Guadalajara? Long time no see. You look great. Do you think I'm really great? How could you leave without telling me? Where have you been? Hey, hey I came all the way back here. You don't need to tell me. Aren't you happy to see me? I'm very happy to see you. But leaving the forest is our taboo. You left the forest, so I don't know if everybody else in the forest will forgive you, Meru. Who cares about taboos? Everybody in this forest? And the humans outside? Both of us are living in the same world. How can we have to draw a line and lock ourselves in like this? That's what I want to know. I've been living in this forest forever. I wish I knew. I'm going to ask the ancestor. I won't ask you anymore. Alrighty. That was kind of cool. Okay, so... More sequences and sequences and such here. I hope I don't have to do any abrupt cut-ups, but... I may. So just a little forewarning. Because I'm at about eight and a half minutes here. I'm home! Oops. It seems that I'm not welcome. I'm not that welcome. It's Meru. Meru is back. This is my home. I can come home anytime. Such selfishness is not tolerated. There is no place to come home to, Meru. But that's true. Who are you guys? You are the black sheep of the proud winglies. How dare you shamelessly come back? I thought you were satisfied with your decadent human life, weren't you? Bardell, what are you talking about? Go back to the humans. And wait there for the moment we destroy the humans. Stop it. The Ancestor. You left the force in your own volition. How come you came back? I just wanted to see everybody. Leaving the force is an unforgivable mortal sin. Didn't you know that when you left for the world of humans? As well as that, you could never come back here. Yes, I did, but it's strange. The world of, is 100 times bigger than this forest. There are, of course, bad humans, but there are, are many good humans, too. You never met them, and you shouldn't hate them. There are people who hate and detest humans just because they are humans, but their number is few. We want to. We just want to protect our life. That's all. Humans have always been afraid of the magic power of Wingleys. They fear, or the fear eventually turns itself into a need to t tyrannize us and take some action, either to subjugate or kill Wingleys. That's why we need our own world in this forest, or like this forest, where humans cannot enter. Go back to the other world. Your existence angers the others. 
I understand. I leave. Meru! Mother! Shoot, not ten minutes already. Leave the girl alone. Father, you must be kidding. You've got to be kidding. That's the rule. We are going. Mother! Father! It must be hard for you, but you must go back, Meru. Get out of our forest at once. Aww. Okay, I'm going to pick this up next time. See you then.